Okay, so we have the <clears throat> fiddlershop.com box that I got today. This is going to be the unboxing. So let's just do this stuff. So this is the Fiddler Man soloist. <clears throat> Pierre Fiddler Man himself actually picked this out for me. So this is how it comes. It comes packaged in this uh, rectangle shaped box. It has some brown packaging to protect it. It has some bubble wrap as well. It had this around it, but I took it off at work. I just I actually have not seen the violin yet, so all I did was open the box at work just to make sure everything was good. So, looks like, if y'all can see on the camera there, get some more of this. So this was wrapped around the black <clears throat> to protect the case because it's a new case they just kind of tied a bow around these around this to protect it see right there there's the bow that they tied and it was wrapped around the case so now I've never seen this violin let's hope it's I'm sure it'll be good I've never I don't actually never actually played violin so I'm not going to be able to test it for you. I'm sorry about that. Wish I could. So here is the case that it came with. It has some... This up here has a open top. And I guess you can just throw stuff in here. You can't actually open the violin from there the violin actually you have to pull this open so let's kind of set that up so you can see it you pull that open and then that's probably some there it is there's a zipper that goes around and this zipper goes around that way so let's open this make sure you can still see on the camera Make sure it's still recording. Okay, so now I'm gonna open the thing. Yep, there we go. Well, smells new. That's good. I'm sure, you know, it would be. It's got a little, uh, whatever that is, those white spots, but that's okay. All right, so we have an adjustment checklist, which is here, signed by Pierre. Fiddler Man, and I guess the Luthier. Not sure what that says, but. So they do the adjustment checklist to make sure that you can play this violin out of the box, is what they say. And I can't hardly see the camera, but there's that. All right, comes with a Fiddler Man nice cloth, which I will be. I can get it in the camera, which I will wipe down, I guess, the violin with. I'll probably end up using this on, if I'm wearing my glasses or something one day instead of contacts, I'll be wiping that as well. That's pretty nice though. That's a nice quality cloth. And here, I guess this is just a cover for the violin. It's got some white on it. White to uh, fluff, whatever those are. Lint. And there's the violin <clears throat> under there all covered up. Let's see. Let's try to see if the camera's good. I hope, hopefully y'all can see okay. Cause I'm just using my iPhone on a little tripod thing. I don't have my good camera anymore. Okay, so what else? Has the bow, here's the bow. This is supposed to be the yellow Holstein something, slim, uh, I forgot what it's called, sandalwood. Yeah, sandalwood bow. Not even exactly sure how to take it out of here. I'm not sure what this thing is. Since I don't, I'm just starting with violin. So this is, I don't want to break it, but I have no idea what that is. I guess maybe it's something to put the bow hair in or something. <laughs> but this comes in there. I'm going to put it back because I'm not going to know where to put that because I don't even know what that thing is. So let's unhook the bow. I'm not sure how to do that either. How do you do that, fiddler man? How do you... How do you take the bow out of here? 
All right, so I got the bow is wrapped in some plastic. Oh, there we go, and I'm gonna slide it out like that. And the bow is in this, so I'm gonna take that out because it's all good. And I guess the bow is gonna already be tightened. It looks like, I'm not exactly sure, but I know that I have to tighten it some. If you can see, I don't have it in the camera, but it's tight, it's almost touching the wood, which I read you're not supposed to keep it like tight all the time, but I guess it's okay to have it like that for now. And then I'll, not sure what that was there, but that's the, it's supposed to be the yellow sandalwood. And it looks like they may, I'm not, I guess that's the normal one. I know they have different ones. It's like $10 more for the, I think that's the frog or something. For like the symbols, I think it's like $10 more for different types. But I think this bow is $100 if you buy it by itself when it's not on sale. So there's the bow. So I know I'm, I'm making you wait for the violin. I know you really just want to see the violin, but let's go through this first. On this side pouch, you can see in there, looks like I got some, I've got the chin rest. I haven't actually, let's see what that looks like. There's the chin rest, Fiddler Man chin rest. I'll have to find out how to use that and set that up. Here's a strap with some keys, I guess it's for the case. I also got some I think it's supposed to be some kind of a, this says violin and viola yumba handmade rosin B. And I guess that's the one that's supposed to come with it. I know they were sold out of Holstein premium or something. I don't know. Rosin was like 12 or $13. I can't remember the name. I don't know if that's the right rosin or not, but you know, I guess this is probably still comparable if that's not the one they said it would come with. Pro or whatever the whole show. I guess that maybe that is the right rosin. That's just a different name on the can. Here's a mute that is supposed to come with. I guess it's a practice practicing tool or something. Here's something else. I don't know what that is, but I'll figure. I'm sure I'll figure it out as more I play violin. Looks like they gave me a keychain too. A little free keychain. I don't know if I have this stuff centered, so I'm sorry if I don't. It looks like that's more center, but hopefully you can still see these things. And then I got this thing. Not sure what it is. It says name on there. Guess I'll open it later. And also, if you can see here, it looks like the, I think that's like a humidity thing or something. It's supposed to tell the humidity. It just has a piece of plastic over it now. That's why it has the numbers. All right, so let's get into the violin here and see what this beast looks like. So, see what Fiddler Man picked out for me here. Hopefully I'm not in the video because I just got out of work and I'm tired. All right, so here's the violin in the bag. If I got it centered, I don't know. Yeah, it looks like that's more centered there. So let's take this beast out see how it looks. It's very light. I didn't think it would be so light. But... Alright, so I'm getting it out of the, this bag. And it has a plastic, I mean a cardboard thing on there. It looks good. Looks great. Uh, hopefully it's in the video. Let me see. I can't tell. Yeah. All right, so it comes this chin rest thing. Here's the violin itself. This is the Fiddler Man soloist, and inside there, I'm not sure if I'm still on camera, it says Fiddler Man soloist, and Fiddler Man, I guess he played this one and thought it sounded good, hopefully. <laughs> All right. I don't really know what I'm doing here. I hope I don't break something, but I'm going to pull these things out of here and just... I'm assuming that's, that's what I'm supposed to do because one day I'm going to be the, a pro at the violin. I'm, I don't know what I'm doing here, but I'm scared. I'm scared I'm going to break this beast. Okay. 
All right, it looks like I got it. And I would play it to see if it was sounded good or something, but I don't know how to play it. It looks like I got the fine tuner here. And I'm guessing here's the the uh, bridge or whatever they call this thing. I'm guessing that's probably, it looks like it's good. It looks like everything's set up correctly. Y'all can tell me, I guess. Doesn't look like shipping messed up anything. It looks perfect to me. I play guitar, and I know this is not really anything to do with guitar or the violin, but I guess I can see if the strings look good. Looks like everything's set up correctly. There it is. It's the violin, the, it's the fiddler man soloist. I guess I can do this. Sounds like it's a pretty good tune as well. That's all I know how to do right now. See, I can play it like the guitar, I guess. But um, there it is. This video is getting a little too long now, but uh, there it is. And the case. <laughs> it's a core. It's got a real good feel. It's soft in here. It's a nice color. I don't think there's... There's probably another opening somewhere in here with something else maybe but looks like you got a bunch of holders for different bows you can put like a four maybe different bows in there i don't know might have to buy the fiber the carbon fiber bow or something i like this case as well but there it is it's the fiddler man soloist unboxing